In the medical industry, if pharmaceutical products or medical devices are contaminated with microorganisms, it could lead to reduced efficacy or even cause infections. Therefore, sterile products should be produced with a septic manufacturing and terminal sterilization, followed by sterility testing to ensure that no viable microorganisms are present in the product. Common sterility testing methods are Membrane filtration and direct inoculation Membrane filtration works best for water-soluble or solvent-soluble samples. Depending on the sample type, different pretreatment procedures may be required. For liquid samples, direct filtration can be performed. For ointments or solid samples, dissolve them in a suitable solvent before filtration. For medical devices with liquid passage, rinse them with sterile solvents and collect the rinse fluid. Next, set up the filtration system. Place a membrane on the apparatus, wet it with sterile solution, and filter the prepared sample. Once done, transfer the membrane to a culture medium and incubate. If the sample contains preservatives or antimicrobial agents, wash the membrane with an appropriate wash buffer before incubation. Incubate the membrane under appropriate conditions for at least 14 days. And observe the medium. If the medium remains clear, it indicates no microbial growth, and the sample complies with sterility testing requirements. If the medium becomes turbid, it indicates the presence of viable microorganisms, meaning the sample does not meet sterility requirements. The direct inoculation method is applicable for samples that can't be filtered or dissolved in solvents. Place the sample directly into a culture medium and incubate it in an incubator. Similar to membrane filtration, incubate the sample under appropriate conditions for at least 14 days. And observe the medium. If the medium remains clear, it indicates no microbial growth, and the sample complies with sterility testing requirements. If the medium becomes turbid, it indicates the presence of viable microorganisms, meaning the sample does not meet sterility requirements. If you're unsure which method to use, check the guide to choose the most appropriate method for your sample. Now you know how sterility tests are performed. If you're looking for suitable vacuum filtration devices, click the link below to visit Rocker's website. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more information. See you next time, bye!